Hello, Colors. Welcome back to Viva Barca. Welcome to another interesting episode where we are going to be discussing on some interesting updates. We start with Dembele as Barca will not receive the entire 50 million euro from Dembele's transfer to PSG. According to Fabrizio Romano's latest report, we are going to discuss on that as we move ahead. Secondly, talking about right back Julian Araujo, who have joined Las Palmas officially on a loan deal. We are also going to be discussing on that. So guys, as we get right into the full stories, please do ensure to subscribe to the channel. Turn on the post bell notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Consider liking the video and please watch it right up to the very end. Osman Dembele's transfer from FC Barcelona to PSG is said to be completed by the end of the week, according to multiple reliable sources. The 26-year-old's 50 million euro release clause expired two nights ago, but Le Parisien will still sign him for the same amount after activating a private clause by sending a formal letter to Barca informing their intention to sign the winger. As Fabrizio Romano clarifies, the private clause is essentially an agreement that Barcelona and Dembele that if any club agrees to pay 50 million for him before July 1st, sorry, before August 1st, and if the player wants to leave, they would green light the operation. And that is how things have panned out as PSG confirmed their willingness to pay 50 million euros for Dembele formally. And the player also informed the La Liga champions of his wish to join them. So now, how much will Barcelona receive for the transfer? It is well known that as part of the contract between the between um with Dembele last year, it was stipulated that Barcelona would receive only half of that 50 million release clause if any club could activate it, with the other half going to the player and his agent. You know, um, so in case PSG had triggered the release clause before Monday's night deadline, Barca would have received just 25 million with the remaining sum going to Dembele and his representatives, Musa Sissoko. But that will no longer be the case with the operation now as PSG did not activate the actual release clause. However, at the same time, Romano clarifies that Barcelona will still not receive the entire 50 million from Dembele's departure to PSG. The Catalan giants will pocket more than 25 million euros that they would have been entitled to in case of the activation of the release clause, but not the entire 50 million euro fee with some portions still likely to end up with the player. Dembele has traveled with a squad to Las Vegas, but did not involve himself in the final pre-season friendly against AC Milan yesterday night, and his exit could be finalized soon after the tour is over. Of course, Usman Dembele's move to PSG continues to look closer and closer with each passing day. Um, 50 million euros has been the price that Fabrizio Romano has said will be paid to Barca, despite the actual release clause still worth 50 million expired on July 31st. But of course, with that formal release clause, Barca were set to to receive just half, which is 25 million. But that, in fact, now that August 1st have already reached this, today we are in August 2nd. You know, Barcelona will receive more than the 25 million because that does not still hold any significance, you know. So let's see how it goes. Barcelona hoping to receive something significant that can help them to sign new players, to boost the squad, to register new signings, which will be very important. And it's time for us to just accept the reality that Dembele will not be part of this team moving forward next season. And I think we even saw Javi yesterday after the game against AC Milan saying that he's disappointed, you know. And he confirmed with his own mouth saying Dembele is leaving, but we have to move on. We even saw some players like, you know, Alonso also spoke after the game saying Dembele will be leaving. 
but the team must move on no matter what we must stream higher and of course it is what it is we just have to move on Dembele's departure for sure is a big blow nobody saw it coming anytime soon and that is how the transfer window always happens a lot of surprises will always be there and so that's just the case with the Dembele situation so let's see Barcelona were hoping to receive more than this 50 million even step the 15 million will not be taken all by them as Fabrizio have said they will receive something higher than the 25 but not the entire 50 million of course PSG did activate a private clause with Dembele's representative as personal terms have already been reached that the player will join the Parisian outfit next season of course we all know PSG came out with this strong interest for Dembele all because of the Kylian Mbappe saga because if Mbappe was set to stay there was no way PSG could have been going strongly for Usman Dembele and I think they are doing that to push Kylian Mbappe out of the club so it's going to be very interesting to see how things unfold then on to the final story of discussion Barca young star Julian Araujo has signed for Las Palmas on a season-long loan deal. The newly promoted La Liga side have confirmed officially, they said. Julian Araujo um, arrived at the Yellows to reinforce the right wing, following a loan agreement with his current club, FC Barcelona, until June 30, 2024, the official statement read. The right back is characterized by his power and strength, with plenty of pace and winner in duels. Araujo had signed for Barca back in January but did not play a single game for the club due to his transfer not being authorized by FIFA. The Mexican international's only appearance for the club came in the post-season friendly game against Vissel Kobe, with Barca going to sign a new right back this summer and given the presence of Sergi Roberto and Jules Koundé ahead of him in the pecking order, Araujo would not have played much in the upcoming campaign and as such the decision was made for him you know to leave on loan and the 21 year old has now signed for Udi Las Palmas for one year the Mexican international did not join the rest of the Basel squad in the USA after his involvement in the Gold Cup and having returned to Spain recently he completed his move to Las Palmas today Araujo will play under the tutelage of former Barca Athletic manager Garcia Pimienta at the Canary Island based club and could stand to benefit a great deal from the experience. So guys, with that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time. Bye-bye.